starting off with my peppermint tea. Um, I'll usually have green tea or peppermint in the morning. And yeah, let's go do a little stretch together, wake up, get the body moving. Start this morning. just in the fridge cooling down I don't like super hot food I've said it many times I know so it's getting to a nice cool temperature for me to eat it <laughs> and I just right now I'm just doing some work I'm filming a lot of content today for my online coaching which I'm super excited about I have a bunch of content for my online coaching right now on the platform that I am using but there's like little inconsistencies, like some videos I'm wearing a different outfit and little things like that. So now that I am getting a lot more clients, I just wanna make sure that it's very uniform. So I'm wearing the same outfit, everything has the same tone, everything like that. So I'm working on that and that should be done within the next three weeks. So super excited to transition into that new phase of my online coaching um, and just make it bigger and better, you know? If I'm not constantly trying to improve, I'm not growing. So working on that, super excited. Just got to transfer those files over. And if you are ever interested in my online coaching, I'm just saying it is worldwide. If you're curious, I do leave um, just my email in the description below. So if you ever want more information, anything like that, go for it. You're more than welcome to reach out to me. I am more than happy to chat and see if what you are trying to achieve is even something that I can help you achieve because just because you reach out to me doesn't mean that I'm gonna be able to take you on as a client. If I don't feel that we would be suited together, I will definitely send you elsewhere and let you know. Don't want you to waste your money. But yeah, just reach out to me, let me know what your goals are, and we'll see if we can make it work. Okay, so we had a little change of plans. I just started working and I never stopped, so that was about two hours. But now I am going to go meet my friend. I have to return a few things at the mall that I bought and I just don't like. And then I have personal training at one. So I'm just gonna do that before I was. So we have made it to the mall. And it is a gloomy day out today. I know all the vlogs coming. It's very autumnal. It is becoming fall. And I'm not gonna lie, just like everyone else, I love this season and I love the cozy vibes having my sweaters on but summer I'm not gonna lie to you it's where I thrive like the sun just keeps me alive it keeps me going it makes me so energetic we're just gonna keep thriving through it stay with me because we will get cozy maybe we'll go to home sense later get a few things pick those up my friend is here I do see her there she is Hi. <laughs> so I have to attend some things I gotta find some things I just got home and I have PT so in 25 minutes. It's right across the street from my house, so I just walk there. It'll take me about five minutes, so no rush. Because right now I'm using the Awani New Hawaiian Shaped Ice. I really like this flavor. I had the like rocket one before, which kind of looks like the like I don't know, rocket ice pops. So I like this one a lot. I used to use Iron Vegan, the pink lemonade, and I love that one I just haven't been able to find it so this is my good second um yeah so I always have a scoop of this today I'm also gonna have a bite of food so I have these midday squares none of this is sponsored I'm just hungry 
little chocolate. These are quite interesting. They're like protein chocolate bars. So 12 grams of protein. But I mean, they're not like low calorie. They're just protein chocolate bars. Oh, this is not bad. It's 150 for this half. That was the most brutal upper body, like shoulder workout I've had in a long time. I typically don't work like shoulders, upper body. Like obviously I work them in certain movements, but it's not intentional. And that's just because I find like my upper body, like when I'm like this, like, my upper body just develops pretty quickly. So I usually try to like avoid it a little bit. Not that anything's wrong with it. I just find for myself that I prefer like lower body, core, all that stuff. Cause if I wanted my upper body to grow, I can do it decently quick. But I like from neglecting it for so long, I've mentioned it before, but I have like shoulder pain and stuff in my left shoulder. So figuring it out, working through it is something I've been doing with my PT. And it's been so awesome because for me, I'm someone who lacks stability so you can either lack mobility or stability and I have a lot of mobility so it's often hard for me to figure out where I should stop within my range of motion so that's something I really work on with PT and that's another reason why I love it because it's easy for me to look at someone else and see what's going on but I can't always see myself in movement so having a PT who really helps me understand my limitations and just once again my range of motion has been super helpful for me and the rest of the day is just up to me love that. Don't you just love a good me day? Like, I'm sorry. Do you see this vegan egg? Like, how does it get this like an omelet, you can put stuff inside of it. Oh my gosh. So what I normally do with it is I roll it up into this like little burrito and then I'll... So this is what I'm gonna be wearing. This is actually the sweater I just bought and these jeans I just got from Zara. I can't help it when I buy something I wear right away. So I got this cute little cropped cardigan here. It does up. I like it open, little flare sleeve. Super sweet. And then these jeans. How can I show you these? I'll go over here. Just fit super nice. Short on the ankle, stand on my bed. Yeah, I can't complain. That's the best I can do to show you. Like, look how sunny it got outside. This is the thing about, at least like fall in Vancouver. The days always start out super gloomy and then they get like this beautiful blue sky, a little bit of cloud, like evening, mid afternoon. It happens every day. You think it's gonna be like pouring rain all day and then the sky just fucking comes out. Yeah, everyone at the mall thinks I'm crazy right now because I'm outside the mall. But we are at home since so that's my favorite place it is super close to my house it's super dangerous it's about like a five minute drive from my place so i'm often here and they're also open later than the entire mall so they close at like 9 p.m which is mm, late night home sense rounds i mean what what's really better not much i'm like not uncomfortable filming in public but i'm uncomfortable filming for example, like I didn't film my personal training session. Like I'm uncomfortable filming other people who are around me because they didn't sign up for this. I I don't mind if people see me carrying my camera, but I yeah, the moment that I have to like bring it out around someone who I'm not super close with, yeah, it's a little bit uncomfortable. Like it's not my favorite thing to do. So you can already see they have like the autumn stuff. Shelves are looking pretty scarce, pretty empty. I am here for the gnomes. Like, why is there Christmas stuff? Like, let's stick to autumn. It's literally not even October yet. Halloween stuff's almost gone. And they're already transitioning to Christmas. Like, I'm sorry, that's not okay. That's far too soon for me. Let's see what we can find, though. Ghostly spirit. 
just subtle little like designs here I love 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 when the lids are like really creative it's just so cute a little boo a little apple so many different little ones here there's a white one a little acorn all the festive mugs here and I'm not sure if you watch Megan Grubbs YouTube but I do <laughs> and last time she was at Homestead she got a pillow that said creeping it real I personally only like a mug that like my full hand can fit in so like one like this like no I need to get my full full hand in there but there's quite a bit here so I'm just gonna look through them all and then we'll see which one I decided to go with. Back home now, and I did just change because I am gonna go for a walk as the sun is setting, and I have to be home by like 5 40 because I am helping Vitae Apparel with their new um, recharge activewear collection launch, which is launching tonight at 6. So I want to make sure I'm home to get my stories posted, etc. This is actually one of the sets. So this is the biker shorts and the long sleeve crop top in the Pantone mint green so yeah I'm just wearing this one for my walk it's super comfy and I was wearing the like longer sleeve pants in my last workout video if you're interested that's what I got on here but let me show you what I got today so first starting with the stuff I got from the mall these are my jeans I got from Zara I already would have shown you me wearing them they're about ankle length just a little bit higher I did roll the bottom so you can see like this much of my ankle and I am 5'5 five five, and my legs are the longest part of me so just for reference I really really like the color of these jeans and the style and the fit I'm obsessed with them I got them in a size 36 so if you want or like these you can just scan that QR code and those will come up it will bring you to their website yeah, so if you scan that QR code, these jeans will come up. It'll bring you right to the website. So that's what those are. And then that little green cardigan I was showing you earlier. So this is just like a little cropped flare sleeve green cardigan. And normally I don't go for color, but it's just so sweet, so innocent. Just so, I really liked it. And it's really cozy, not itchy at all. Super thin fabric, so just a really good throw on. Um, for this one, I got in a size medium, and this is just the QR code for that one. Otherwise, I just got a little crop top, just a little soft black tank top here. I got this extra small. It was just $15. I love wearing just like little tops around the house or under a sweater. So I got that one, and then I also grabbed this little one here saying just super soft little tops super stretchy just for wearing around the house with jeans and just under tops so that is all i got for clothing wise and then i just restocked on my face wash here so for my face wash i use the drunk elephant bestie number no. nine jelly cleanser so that's this one right here and i only use this once a day so i use this at night i do have my full skincare routine videos um, on my channel my morning and night so they do now let's move to the fun stuff which is home scents I went a little out of my elements and I got a black candle so this one I couldn't resist it it has a little cat on it and this looks just like Otis like green eyes black cat I couldn't say no so this is the sand and fog pumpkin harvest and it's super subtle, super nice. I don't like really aggressive smelling candles. I find they make me sneeze. Yeah, I don't know, allergies, but when a candle is like really scented, I'll like sneeze all the time. So very nice, very subtle, just classic. And then I got these, which are just like a longer wicked candle for one of my holders and a nice like ambery orange um, color so that this can go in my candle holder and these are just unscented but festive color and then I got this beauty so this is a little pumpkin pillow for my couch and both sides have the pumpkin it is no joke 
the comfiest pillow and it was $29.99 Canadian, so $30. So I am not mad about that because this will last me forever. So got that sweet little pillow. And then lastly, we had to get a festive mug. Like I love tea, I love mugs and they just make me so happy. And I'm the type of person where I don't keep my festive mugs out all year. So like my Christmas ones are packed away and I bring them out for Christmas and then my autumn ones will be packed away, I'll bring them out. And it just makes me so excited. Like when I transition to those mugs, I get in the feels and this one was so cute. So it has these little pumpkins on it. My full, I usually hold it with this hand. So my full four fingers, full hand fits in there. I can hug it nice and cozy. And then it says, hello pumpkin. Like, oh, I just love it so much. It has the little baby gourds on there. And those are my pickups. That's what I got. But I am gonna go for a little walk right now because like I said, I wanna get some of that sunshine while it's still here. And yeah, I gotta be home and make some posts and do some work. So time to put all this stuff away, but I'm super happy with my purchases. So all good stuff. <laughs> So I just finished posting everything on my Instagram for the Vitae Apparel new recharge launch. That is all done. I am just gonna get started on making dinner. I do have my friend on FaceTime back here. She's just chilling, getting ready for work. Oh, that's a good angle. What are you doing? She's tying up her scrubs. Uh huh. So yeah, I'm just gonna start prepping dinner. I'm gonna cut up some butternut squash. Some tofu. That's what we'd be doing. Now that my dinner is in the oven, let's just try to get this house a little bit more festive. So Jay's not home until a little bit later. He's out for dinner. So I have all this time to myself. And we normally have like a TV right here, but all summer we take it away and we just tuck it away in our like storage room because we just don't watch TV much in summer. We only ever watch like one show before bed, so we'll just use the TV in the bedroom. And like we just like to have a big open view, all the windows throughout the summer and just let all that light in. But in winter we like to bring it out, watch a movie together out here. So I think I'm gonna get that out. So that will be a little surprise. Hyper kitty. And yeah, just start setting up a little bit of the stuff we got, so let's just get to it. I hope this fits. I think it should. I just have this little candle holder. Twist it in. Yeah. Good. Super long, super cute. <laughs> Looks pretty ugly like this, but once it starts to burn, I love these. One thing about HomeSense, like these tags, they they really gotta change it. I swear to God, it has like 
50 different little like sections to it, like little holes, so that I guess so you don't change the prices on things. But like HomeSense, you're not an expensive store. Like for the most part, you're very well priced. Some things are like oddly more expensive than they should be, but everything else is very well priced, like candles, everything like that. You do not need these stickers. Like I'm not trying to switch price tags. I'm not trying to steal. And it really irks my whole experience. Um, so I'm sure you're aware if you shop at HomeSense that these little tags are just the absolute worst. I almost forgot to show you. So I picked up these like dish towels this way the other week. So. I got these like last week at a different home sense. Um, so just a little set of these little festive gnomes. Look how cute they are. They're pumpkin, sunflower. Oh, so I'm gonna get these out too. All right, so this is pretty much what we're working with for now. So we got the little pumpkin pillow out. Now I always have like a duvet, blankets, and I have another bin over here just like filled with blankets because personally, if your couch doesn't have like pillows and blankets on it, I don't want to sit in it. Like I want to be like comfy as can be. So yeah, that's my couch if you ever come here. Blankets, pillows all over. And then we got the little candle section going. It's just my mini tea lights, the little Otis light, another tea light, got the TV back out here, some fairy lights along the floor with my extremely melted candle in there, and my little orange one. It's good, and I also have my like lights on outside, so once it gets a bit darker, you will see them and my very spooky dead mint and basil plant. So that's fitting for autumn. So for dinner, I have roasted butternut squash, smoked tofu, beets, broccoli, and then pesto tahini on top with my pumpkin spice tea. I have my TV on so you can hear that. But yeah, that's really it for today. I'm just gonna cut up on the couch, wait for Jay to get home and eat my dinner. So I really hope you enjoyed this vlog. And as always, I hope you have a beautiful morning, evening, night wherever you may be, just have a beautiful day today. Seriously.